Canadian folklore and ghost stories as retold by author Becca Ferguson. Narrated by Robbie Ferguson. Taking place in 1978, this is the Tunnel Monster of Cabbage Town, Ontario. In the early 19th century days of Toronto, there were many rivers, streams, and creeks branching across the land like veins and arteries. Endless trees towered above the developing city rather than skyscrapers. And down in the riverbeds of these yet rural wilds lived a race of water spirits known in Algonquin mythology as Memekwesi. These elusive humanoid creatures were elfish, small and hairy, with voices said to be like the high-pitched drone of a dragonfly. When city builders rerouted these waterways into solid underground tunnels that merged with the sewer system, it is thought that the Mamegwesi were unknowingly buried with them. By the early 20th century, Torontonians had long forgotten the existence of these vast tunnels. That is, until one summer's day in 1978 in an area of the city known as Cabbage Town. A man named Ernest stumbled upon a secret entrance to the tunnels while searching for a lost kitten. Certain he had heard distressed mewling down in the alley beside his Parliament Street apartment the night before, he decided to army crawl into the culvert about ten feet, flashlight in hand. The tunnel gradually widened, its black depths like an abyss. Something skittered ahead, and he steadied the flashlight beam, hoping to see his kitten. But it was no cat caught in the beam. A pair of slanted red eyes bulged at him above the gaping, large-toothed mouth of a hairy, gray, bipedal creature about three feet long. Go away! Go away! It screeched and ran off into a side tunnel. Terrified, Ernest shimmied back out of the tunnel and waited a full year before admitting to the Toronto Sun newspaper what he had seen. However, when they went in search of the tunnel's entrance, they found it collapsed in upon itself, and no one has ever admitted to such a sighting again. This has been the Tunnel Monster of Cabbage Town, Ontario, part of Becca Ferguson's Canadian Folklore and Ghost Stories series. Catch the complete and ever-growing series on Wattpad or directly on the author's website, BeccaFerguson.com. Like, comment, and be sure to subscribe so you don't miss the next tale.